Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel for another video. Today I am doing my March 2016 birch box. I just got my birch box in the mail yesterday and I did look inside of it because I am doing this a little bit different than last month's video. I actually wanted to look inside of it first so that I could utilize all of the products in today's video and kind of do mini reviews as we go along. So please let me know how you like this style and give this video a big thumbs up if you like birch box unboxings and also hit this button right here to subscribe to my channel and be part of the family and to get notified of all my new videos. Another thing I am going to do differently is at the end of the video I am going to rate this month's box out of five because if you know Birchbox it is a monthly subscription box for ten dollars and you get five makeup, skincare, beauty, you know it could be any type of product but you get five of them so I'm going to do the rating out of five. So without further ado let's get into this month's box. So first of all, can we just take a moment to appreciate how beautiful this month's box is. I absolutely love the gold detailing and the color of this box because like I said in my previous video, I do display these around my room. So this one is very pretty. So according to the card, this month's box is all about Women's Day and Women's History Month from March. And it says that we'll be talking about how to use products to amplify your features not cover them up, and work with your hair texture, not against it. So this month's box is all about expressing yourself as a woman, not trying to cover up how you look, cover up your hair, your face, anything like that, but just kind of to amplify your features. The first product I'm going to talk about is the Wilma Schumann Skin Care. These are hydrating collagen eye pads. The full size is $18. And it says these 100% pure collagen pads hydrate and plump the skin around your eyes for a bright and youthful look. This is what the packaging looks like. It's actually like a, they're pretty big pads so they will fit under your whole under eye not just kind of just right beneath your eye. Um, this is the only product I didn't test out for this video because I am actually giving my mom this product for this month. The next product and the one I'm kind of most disappointed in is the FHI brand's Hot Sauce Thermal Heat Activated Conditioner. The full size of this is $16 and it claims that the lightweight formula penetrates individual follicles to moisturize, condition, and strengthen from the inside out. Here's this, it's just a little tube. The reason I didn't like this is I did put it in my hair when it was still damp like the instructions say to do and honestly like my hair just feels really kind of greasy to the touch. Not what normal leave-in conditioners usually do for my hair. Um, I just washed my hair today and I usually go two to three days without washing my hair again but honestly like after using this product I think I'm going to wash my hair again tomorrow just to get it out. Another weird thing about this is that there was actually little beads inside of it kind of like an exfoliant that you use on your face and I just kind of thought how is this really going to blend into your hair? Is it just going to be sitting in my hair all day? Um, so overall, I'm not too happy with this product, but it was nice to try out another leave-in conditioner. Now, the other hair product I got in my box this month, I absolutely love, and I do really like it. It is the Parlor by Jeff Chastain. I'm probably saying that so wrong. Um, but it is the Smoothing Blowout Spray. The full size is $24. Here's the bottle. It's actually a very big sample size. It is one fluid ounce, so I will get a lot of use out of this. First of all, it smells really good. It's really fresh. Kind of reminds me of the It's a 10 leave-in spray, that smell. Um, I like this because it didn't feel too heavy on my hair. And when I blow dried my hair today, I actually did notice a big difference in the volume. But if I pull all of my hair to the front, you will see there's actually quite a bit of volume going on here. And if you look in other videos of mine, especially when I have my hair kind of straightened, you won't really see that. So I'm actually very impressed that despite my heavy, thick hair, this actually did add quite a bit of volume. The last two products in this month's box were both makeup related, which are my favorite to get. The first is this Marcel BB Cream Golden Glow. The full size is $28, so that is pretty pricey. It says, this multitasking BB cream gives your skin a golden glow while controlling shine and masking imperfections. So I zoomed in on my skin so you could kind of see it today. Um, I know the lighting changed a little bit. It's really bright now. 
But as you can see, cover my imperfections I have going on right now. Um, I have some on my forehead, on my chin. I didn't really cover much, but I do feel like in real life it does have a nice glow. I do like this. I just applied it with a wet beauty blender. The last product and the favorite from this month's box is the Trace Tweet. Trace Teak. Trace 2K? Trace Teak? I don't know. I have no idea what I'm saying. Um, it is the Color and Smudge Shadow Crayon in Aspen Pine. The full size is $26. The size that they give you, this is actually very generous. I wouldn't even really need to go out and ever buy the full size. But if you look here, I have it smudged on the lower lash line a little bit. And then I also have it on the outer half of my eye. It's a very pretty shadow, especially for green or blue eyes. I really do like it. I'll swatch it for you on the back of my hand. It's actually pretty dark, but you can see the really nice pine color that they describe it as. Overall, I am going to give this month's box a 3 out of 5. That is only because 3 out of the 5 products I actually think I am going to utilize and use, which is the shadow stick, the blowout spray, and also the eye patch, just because I think that's a really cool thing to throw in. Please leave me a comment down below telling me what you got in your box, if you got anything different from me. I love going around watching videos and seeing what other people got compared to my boxes. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please let me know if you like this format of the unboxing better than last month's, and I will talk to you guys next time. Have a great day. Bye!